Hello everyone, this is Reza. I'm a PhD candidate at Iowa State University. As a language instructor, I'm always looking for ways to engage my students and provide them with meaningful listening practice. One resource I've found particularly effective is TED-Ed videos. In this demonstration, I will outline my approach for using a TED-Ed video with high intermediate level students. I start by going to the TED-Ed website, then I type the word superstitions in the search tab. It looks like the video called Where Do Superstitions Come From is the most viewed video on superstitions. And it perfectly aligns with my lesson topic, so I decided to choose this video. The lesson will be approximately 100 to 120 minutes in duration and will be divided into three stages, pre-listening, while listening, and post-listening. In the pre-listening stage, I will use a selection of pictures from the video to pique my students' interest in the topic. I'll also introduce relevant vocabulary and concepts. This will provide an opportunity for them to practice predicting skills and activate their prior knowledge. To do this, I will have students work in small groups to brainstorm as many words as possible based on the pictures and then present their guesses for the video's topic to the class. I will also incorporate two additional pictures from the video that feature terms to further enhance my students' understanding of the content. For the while listening stage, I have prepared two handouts to facilitate my students' practice of note-taking and listening for comprehension. The first handout is an incomplete outline of the video's lecture, which my students will complete as they watch. They will then work in small groups to compare and discuss their answers before discussing them as a whole class and verifying them against the video. The second handout contains questions about the main ideas and details of the video, which my students will answer individually before discussing their responses in small groups. We will then reconvene as a whole class to review and confirm the answers using the video as a reference. In the post-listening stage, I want my students to make connections between the topic and their own experiences and express their opinions on it. To accomplish this, I will have them work in small groups to generate their own questions about the topic, which they will present to the class. They will also have the opportunity to share any personal experiences or beliefs they have related to superstitions. Then they'll participate in a class discussion on the possible origins and functions of these beliefs. Finally, my students will write a short paragraph expressing their thoughts on superstitions, including whether they believe in them and their rationale for their stance. Overall, I believe this lesson plan effectively combines engaging and authentic listening material. I hope it gives you some ideas about how to integrate TED-Ed videos into your listening lesson plans.